Hi, and welcome to the Holter Museum of Art. My name is Rosemary Howell. I'm the Associate Curator and Collections Manager here. Thank you for joining us for our continued virtual exhibit tour at the Holter Museum of Art while we're all shut down and at home and uh, close to the public. Hopefully we'll be opening up back soon, but for now, uh, we're gonna continue our virtual exhibit tour. Right now we're in Takaway, uh, commemorating the Wounded Knee Massacre. Um, this is, exhibit was organized by the Center for American Indian Research and Native Studies in Martin, South Dakota. Uh, there are 46 Lakota artists in this show. Um, and that is included uh, uh, painters, photographers, glass workers, poets, um, musicians, uh, a huge variety of work here, uh, all from Lakota artists, all talking about and commemorating the Wounded Knee Massacre uh, on, that happened on December 29th, 1890. Thank you so much for joining us again. We're really excited again to bring you uh, the, these amazing shows uh, to your very home. Uh, so thank you again and here we go. So the title of this exhibition is Talk Away. Uh, Talk Away, translated in English, is the word why. This exhibit is asking 46 Lakota artists to commemorate, respond to, think through the Wounded Knee Massacre that happened on December 29th in 1890, where 300 uh, Lakota people were slaughtered by the U.S. government, um, majority women and children. Uh, so the, the exhibit is very heart-wrenching. Uh, it takes you through um, a sort of positive to the assassination, to internment, to the proposal uh, at the very end, which is for Lakota people to continue to comment on the Wounded Knee Massacre and not forget it, continually commenting um, on these situations. The work is so varied and it's so uh, it varied in multiple ways from medium to, uh, you know, a lot of it is traditional, a lot of it is very contemporary, uh, a lot of it is craft, there's music and poems. Um, you can go on the Talk Away uh, website, Center for American Indian Research and Native Studies website. Uh, all of the songs and poems are under um, the Talk Away tab on that website. So you should just be able to type in Center for American Indian Research and Native Studies um, and get, get straight to the songs and the poems, um, which are a huge, huge uh, informational part of this exhibit. Uh, and also there is so much information about this exhibit, uh, so much uh, misinformation that's being upended. You know, for instance, uh, it's thought that the massacre only lasted um, a very short time uh, and it all happened very fast uh, when really they found that it ha uh, you know, the Center for American Indian Research and Native Studies found that this massacre happened all day, um, you know, uh, 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 and it was a slaughter. I, a lot, of, a lot of, uh, of misinformation out there calls it a battle and things like that. And, and that's a huge reason why we want to, wanted to uh, show this show to stop the spread of misinformation and, and um, you know, call it what it is and, and, and really bring to light um, this instance and, and how these 46 Lakota artists are responding to it. So again, as you're looking through, um, really just notice the variety in materials, the variety in the different ways these people can respond to the same 
the very same story, the very same uh, tragedy. Uh, there are so many ways uh, to think through problems like these. And uh, I think that all of these artists have succeeded in, 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 in relaying how they think through um, this, this horrific tragedy to us. So um, really just take your time looking through the video, uh, uh, looking at the materials. There's some beautiful glass work. There's some beautiful textile work, beautiful painting, beautiful traditional work. I really hope that you enjoy it and think about it and, and uh, have a chance to read through some of the information on the uh, Center for American Indian Research and Native Studies website. everybody at home, thank you so much for joining us for this virtual tour. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. If you're looking to help us help support the museum through this tough time, the best way you can support us is to become a member. Uh, we thrive on our members. Uh, we invite our members to private events. Our members get uh, discounts and perks from local businesses. You get discounts in the store as a member. Uh, you can join for as little as $60 a year. And it's really just an incredible way to support us. So thank you so much, and uh, we hope you will tune in for our next virtual exhibit tour. Thank you.